Hello everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I have started a new video series where I will be telling you various fascinating and informative things about different territories of India. So let's start with Uttarakhand. On the foothills of Himalayas, there is an enchanting land named Uttarakhand, which adds five stars to the beauty of northern India. Politically, Uttarakhand state was formed on the 9th of November 2000, when it was carved out from Uttar Pradesh to form 27th state of India known as Uttaranchal to give tribute to those who fought for the state in the name of Uttarakhand. It is often referred to as the Dev Bhumi due to numerous Hindu temples and pilgrimage centers found throughout the state. The state is divided into two divisions, Garhwal and Kumaon, with a total of 13 districts. The winter capital of Uttarakhand is Dehradun which is the largest city of the state. On the 4th of March 2020 Gaisain town in Chamoli district was declared the summer capital of the state. The high court of the state is located in Nainital. Trivendra Singh Rawat is the 8th and current chief minister of Uttarakhand. With a meager population of 10.39 million, Uttarakhand is the state that sends the highest numbers of officers in the Indian Army per capita of the population. While Uttar Pradesh may have the highest number of officers in Indian Army, when divided by the state population, Uttarakhand tops the chart. The primary official language of Uttarakhand is Hindi, and secondary language is Sanskrit. Other language like Kumaoni, Gadwali, Jonsari was also spoken there. Now let's check out, Symbols of Uttarakhand. Emblem, Diamond Shield. Flower, Brahma Kamal. Tree, Buras. Butterfly, West Himalayan Common Peacock. Mammal, Alpine Musk Deer. Instrument, Dhol Unofficial Suite, Bal Matai Unofficial Fruit, Kafal Let's check out some unique specialities of Uttarakhand. Tunganat is the highest Shiva temples in the world and is located in the mountain range of Tunganat in Rudraprayag district of Uttarakhand. The Tunganat mountains form the Mandakini and Dilaknanda river valleys. It is located at an altitude of 3,680 meters. With the elevation of 7,816 meters above sea level, Nanda Devi is the highest mountain in Uttarakhand and the second highest mountain in India, following Kanchanjunga in Sikkim. Hemkun Sahib formerly known as Gurudwara Shri Hemkun Sahib Ji, is a Sikh place of worship in Chamoli district of Uttarakhand. It is at an elevation of 4,632.96 meters. Char Dham of Uttarakhand or Chota Char Dham is one of the most important Hindu pilgrimages in India. It comprises of four most holy sites of Uttarakhand, namely, Bedrinath, Kedarnath, Gangotri and Yamunotari. Bidrinath is considered one of the most holy places in Hindu religion. Bidrinath temple is part of both Char Dham and Chota Char Dham. Situated in the Rudraprayag district of Uttarakhand, Kedarnath is the most remote pilgrimage spot in the Yatra. It is believed that originally the temple of Kedarnath was built by Pandavas. Gangotri Dham is dedicated to Goddess Ganga. The river originates at Gomukh from the Gangotri Glacier which is some 18 km from the town of Gangotri situated in Uttarkashi district of Uttarakhand. The original temple of Gangotri was built by Amar Singh Thapa, a Gorkha general in the early 19th century. Yamunotri is where the second most holy river of India, the river Yamuna takes birth. Situated in the Uttarkashi district of Uttarakhand, Yamunotri Dham is the first stop in the pilgrimage. It is believed that bathing in its water cleanses all sins and protects from untimely and painful death. The shrine of Yamunotri is believed to be built in 1839 by the king of Teri, Naresh Sudarshan Shah. 
Terry Dam is the highest dam in India, with a height of 260.5 meters. It is a multi-purpose rock and earth fill embankment dam on the Bhagirathi River near Terry. Jim Corbett National Park is the oldest national park in India and was established in 1936 as Haley National Park to protect the endangered Bengal tiger. It is located in Nainital district and Pori Garhwal district of Uttarakhand and was named after Jim Corbett who is a well-known hunter. The region of Valley of Flower is rich in varied flora and fauna. The Valley of Flower was declared as the National Park of India in year 1982 and it is now a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The virgin beauty of this mystical valley has always lured botanists, nature lover and adventure lover. GB Pant University of Agriculture and Technology, also known as Pantnagar University, is the first agricultural university of India. It was inaugurated by Jawaharlal Nehru on the 17th of November 1960 as the Uttar Pradesh Agricultural University. Now let's check out some famous tourist places of Uttarakhand. This is Oli. Oli is in Chamoli district in the Himalayan mountains of Uttarakhand located at an elevation of 2,800 meters above sea level. Oli is a hike and ski destination. Between June to October, the valley has one of highest number of flower species found anywhere in the world, with 520 species of high altitude plants, 498 of which are rare flowering plants with significant populations of endangered species. This is Haridwa. Haridwa is an ancient city and important Hindu pilgrimage site in North India, where the river Ganga exits the Himalayan foothills. The largest of several sacred ghats, bathing steps, Harki Pori hosts a nightly Ganga Aarti, river worshipping ceremony, in which tiny flickering lamps array floated of the steps. This is Masuri. Masuri is a charming hill station in India, known for its colonial charm, beautiful churches, and scenic surroundings. Nestled in the foothills of the Himalaya, this place is flocked by tourists around the year. This is Nanital. Nainital is a popular hill station in Uttarakhand. It is also known as the judicial capital of Uttarakhand. This is Rishikesh. Rishikesh, known as the birthplace of yoga, is located at the foothills of the Himalayas along the sacred Ganga River. It is a haven for travelers looking for spirituality and solitude. There are many more other destinations such as Ilmora, Munsiari, Dehradun, Lansdowne and Rani Khet. Uttarakhand is also very famous amongst tourists for various adventurous sports such as trekking, paragliding, skiing, whitewater rafting, camping, bungee jumping, zipline activities, canoeing and kayaking, cable car ride and many more. Let's move to the cultural and traditional site of Uttarakhand. Folk Dances of Uttarakhand Food of Uttarakhand Some unique festivals celebrated in Uttarakhand Hope you like this informative video, do like and share for more such knowledgeable videos.